This was a very, uh, very interesting uni symposium. I think we learned more about the uh, the effect of yogurt, not only as a very important component of the diet, but also how it can help to manage uh, body weight gain, and also, of course, the disease associated with obesity, such as type 2 diabetes, for example. I think, of course, uh, there are several food items. There are several uh, ways by which nutrition can help to reduce uh, obesity. And today, I think we learn again that uh, yogurt is part of a dietary patterns of uh, very good food that can help to prevent weight gain. And we went a little bit further at the CNE Symposium trying to understand the mechanism that can be behind this uh, very good effect of yogurt. Because a small reduction in weight gain or a small reduction in obesity can have a major impact on disease associated with obesity, mainly type 2 diabetes. And because there is now more epidemi epidemiological evidence that uh, yogurt consumption can limit type 2 diabetes, I think I want to learn more how it works. Why do we get less diabetes if we eat yogurt? Is it because we are eating in a be better dietary pattern, better nutrition? Is it nutrition quality? Or there's some constituents in yogurt that can explain this wonderful effect of yogurt? We have now, um, I would say, confirmation by many studies in different groups that there is a weight-reducing effect or weight-preventing effect of yogurt. We have also many publications coming out uh, that are already published and some coming out that metabolic syndrome and type 2 diabetes, uh, the risk for developing those are reduced in yogurt consumers. And I think these are very important. And again, I think the next step is to understand how it's working. And we need randomized clinical trials. We need more mechanistic studies. But it's very promising.